Alright guys, so first off, you go to this website, we will have a link in the description. You download it by just clicking download radio. You will then get a download and you're going to have to get this file. In the download, you'll see these three files. So, once you have these files, you go into your programs. For me, it's in my C boot. You go to your Steam apps, click Steam, go to Steam apps, common, then you find Arma 3. Once you're in the Arma 3 file, you go to the files that you've just downloaded. There we go. Then you have this little file here, Arma 3, in the one that you just downloaded. You click it, and then you have these three files. What you want to do now, in case you already had a TFR installed but it's not working, you find these three files in here. Okay, so let's say you find this one, this one, and then the user config. Then you just delete all of three of them. Then you put these three, just drag them in here, so it should look like this, have them in there. Alright, after that, you go all the way back and you find your TeamSpeak. Find TeamSpeak client, for me it's in my C again, 86, TeamSpeak 3 client. You open it up, make sure your TeamSpeak 3 is closed at this point. Then here you have the plugins. If you click on it, you have normally some files in it. If you don't want to lose your others, you should make a backup. But the best thing to completely fix it, in case you're here for an issue, you just delete everything that is in here. Completely everything. Then in the file that you just downloaded, you take all these files out. You just drag them in there, and that's it. Good to go. Then, you open your TeamSpeak, have the settings, plugins, then here is our Task Force Arma 3 radio, as you can see. What you do, just click here, or if it's not in there yet, you just click Reload All, then it should appear. You click here, and just close it. Everything should work fine. Enjoy your game.